Hey there YouTube followers, this is Michael of Painting War Games, and today I'm not talking about models actually because um you know I'm I'm a little under the weather. Um so but with that said, uh went and took a little bit of my tax return and I bought a Nintendo 3DS. Uh this is a refurbished one from GameStop, 159 bucks. Not bad. Um, you know, I will I was contemplating on getting a brand new one, but the XLs are two hundred and I'm like, well, you know, I only want to spend X amount of money. I, I wanted to spend under, under, or under two hundred dollars, um, like for my purchases. Um, so I got the refurbished. It's the blue aquamarine. Not bad. It's in relatively good condition. I like it. Um, notably, it is a little bit bigger than the DSi or the DS, but still, nonetheless. And what game did I pick up for it? I know this is gonna sound weird coming from a tabletop gamer, but hey man, I remember when the first generation came out with these Pokemon X. Picked it up, been playing it. Um, really haven't been painting a whole lot since I picked it up. Uh, you know, I got this guy here. Uh, his head's actually kind of loose, but yeah. Got this Jack here that I've been working on, or that I should be working on. But yeah, I just, I've been Watching this uh, live play or this LP on Teching 101, um, I will put his name in the description below. Great channel. He talks about Bleach manga reviews. Uh, he's doing a um, LP of Pokemon White, which is for the original DS. Um, I didn't play Generation Five. Um, I played Generation Four, which I think, yeah, I played Generations One through Four. Um, I didn't play Generation 5, and then this is Gen 6. I believe this is Gen 6. Maybe this is Gen 5. I don't know. Yeah, this is Gen 6, yeah. This is Generation 6. So, yeah, um, I've been watching his LP of Pokemon White, and I'm like, oh, man, you know, suddenly I hadn't played Pokemon since Generation 4. So, I was like, ah, you know, I, I had contemplated on getting a DS, a 3DS, um, and so, yeah, you know, I finally just coughed up for it. And there are a couple good games for the 3DS. Um, I know Link's, um, A Link Between Two Worlds, Two Worlds, um, it's a, um, it's a sequel to A Link to the Past, which is on the Super Nintendo, one of my favorite Zelda games, um, next to Ocarina of Time, so I'm definitely going to be picking that up and playing that on here in the near future on the 3DS. Um, not that I'm going to not you know, paint, um, and not play, it's just, these, you know, little handheld games are great for pickups, you know, um, you know, if you're on a bus, or if you're on a road trip, or you're at home, and you're like, you know, you're getting burnt out painting, and I think I was getting to the point where I was burning myself out on painting a little bit, um, so I've just sort of been taking a break and watching YouTube videos of LPs, um, so yeah, um, you know, um, that's really about it. It's just an update of what I've been doing. Um, so yeah, guys, um, if you if you're a Pokemon fan, I suggest you know picking up a 3DS. Um, they don't make the original ones anymore. You got to get them refurbed um, from GameStop. But for 149 to 159 bucks, because um, I know if you go online, it's like 10 bucks cheaper. But then you got shipping and all that. Um, these are not a bad deal. I mean, they offer a 30 day warranty, and you can buy an additional one year warranty. This thing is been held up pretty good um, and of course uh, with any game I buy new games I'll buy used systems like used game consoles like the 3ds but for like Pokemon um, and any RPGs I like to buy brand new um, just who I am so all right guys this is uh, Michael of Pain and War Games I'm keeping it short today so uh, yeah as always keep gaming